All right, so here we are. It is uh, June 2nd, and uh, this is an awesome time of year. And that's the single brood chamber. I've already done the honey supers. Uh, that'll be a separate video, just so they're not really long. It takes forever to download. But anyways, so we're gonna get in here. Uh, last week, I made my first split off these girls, and I wanna see what they've done with those three new deep frames. Hopefully they drew them out nice. And uh, make sure we don't have any swarm cells. Make sure my queen's not on there. There we go. All right, so I'm just gonna dive in here. And hopefully, I knock them back enough so they can focus on honey. Well, the flow is cranking right now and not on swarming. So let's take a peek. All right, girls, all right. I already see my super procedure cups. I'm just gonna pull this frame. <laughs> every week, every week they have these super procedure cups on this frame down here, nothing in them. Chickens are going mad. They're not even happy about it. Look at the pollen though. Capping honey in the corners. So this is a great food frame. A little bit of room on the outer edge so I know that I haven't run out of room yet. So far, anyways, I haven't run out of room yet for the nectar coming in. So let's get a peek here. All right, so we got, I'm gonna lean it to me. So we've got a, we've got a emerging brood on this frame. She hasn't been back down the sun, at least not this frame right here. There's no eggs. And that right there is all drones. This is a wonky drone frame. Kind of wacky right here. All right, so I don't see her. So I don't see eggs either in this frame. So we've got a little bit of time. So we're not shutting her down. There's not, they've got plenty. Come on, girls. They still have plenty of room. So this frame right here was brand new to them last week. This is one of the empties that I put in and they've got probably a good Two thirds of it drawn out and she's got eggs in it. So this is what she's done. She's literally come right in and she's got eggs in here. So they're drawing it out and she's filling it. So maybe that bounced her back. We'll see, I don't see her on this frame, but I see eggs. So that's a good sign. Looks good girls, come on. Let me just sneak in there. So I checkerboarded those frames. Just so, just so they draw them out better, just in case. The flow, there's a cup. Let's take a peek here. I'm just looking for my queen real quick. But this is all, so we got eggs and larvae on the bottom, cat brood on the top. Not seeing anything I need to worry about. So we got a couple cups down on the bottom. Come on, get out of the way. A couple cups, nothing in them. You gotta be careful of this dr uh, drone brood that they make, because next thing you know, there's a, there's a cell shooting straight off the bottom, so. it's another cup over here but I'm not seeing any, no eggs. So maybe that split was enough. But then again, this hive really never showed. They weren't super swarmy to begin with. So this is a great hive to get reproduced. Get the genetics from this queen. Good honey hive, not swarmy. All right, 
A little angry at times, that's for sure. Big though, big, big hive. So let's take a peek. I'm not quite sure about this one. No, this wasn't me. Cat brood, cat brood, pollen. All right, so I think that looks good. So we're, uh, we're almost to the center. Nice, there's nothing better than an uneventful single. Oh, look at the sun. Ooh, that just came out nice. And here we are, the beginning of June, and they're not they're not going swarm crazy. That three three frames last week did the trick so far. I'll probably have to do, which I don't mind. Get another three frame, two framer offer uh, in a couple of weeks. And then that should hold her over right to, oh, this is a new frame. Look at that. Look at the brand new comb. I'm gonna turn it this way, eggs in it. So not only did I give them three new frames, so far they've drawn them out, but she's come right in and stuffed them with eggs. So it opened up what, 3,500 cells on one side, 7,000 cells per frame. So that really opens it up. So you do the math on this, right? So there's 35 to a side, 3,500 cells, 7,000 total. If she's laying 1,500 in a day, right? You're talking four, four and a half days, she could fill a frame. Okay, it goes, all right, all right. That's why the single brood chamber works if you do the math. She can't lay enough. That's why you just gotta make sure that you don't, they don't get pollen bound, honey bound. But anyways, you look at that, that's a beautiful, beautiful example of them just cranking. Hopping right on it. Oh, look at that. So in a week, they've done so far two. Oh, there she is right there. Faded green dot. Let's see if you can see that. There she is. Hello. She looks good. So, just got to make sure there's no cells around her. Cat brood. Pollen. So the beauty of this, this is a... Uh, She's on this side, so I gotta go slow, easy. Look at that. So I just got three new frames. Where did you just, where did you just go? You went to the other side, didn't you? Did you go under? I gotta make sure I know where she is before I put her back. I don't want her on the end, I don't want her on the bottom. She's in the center, hello. All right, good, good, good. So like I said, that's uh, three new frames, brand new frames, frame rotation. If I make two splits off her, so three and a five, that's five new frames a year that they're getting. So, helps with that. You gotta think about everything. But anyways, right now it's all about honey and splits. Look at this one. Ooh, look at that. Oh, that's a solid sheet of cat bird. Ooh-wee. No cells, nothing. So it worked. This week, this hive, it worked. My other one, it didn't. Oh. My other one, I had to knock them back down again. So let me just get a couple more. Hold on, girls. Hold on, girls. There we go. Check the last two here, see how they're doing. All right, that's all young larvae. 
all young larvae. That's pearly white. Little larvae in there. I don't think. Oh, that's the one. I put it on the end. So I did two in the two kind of in the middle, and then one on the end. I wasn't sure how far they were gonna get. So I don't see anything on there. That's beautiful. So that's it. So we did uh, three flame, uh, frame split last week. Sorry, ladies. This is funny. If it's not in the middle, look at what they do. They take their time. That's it. Nothing really to see right there. That needs to be drawn out. Where was she? All right, I'm not going to mess with it. I'm going to leave it because I'm going to put on a... a undrawn honey super so I want them to draw that out so that's it we've uh three frame split beginning of June end of end of May into June right now these girls are content on bringing their honey they're not thinking about swarming I got nice beautiful genetics off of her That's it. Anyways, June 2nd, single brood chamber, and then not making swarm cells. Thank you for watching.